How's your aunt? closely my hair is not black this is my natural hair color i'm just going to use a regular regular box dye this is the clarol one that i always get on sale at shoppers drug mart like it's hair dye it does the job i don't need to buy like the most expensive especially if you're just going black the mission is to not get this anywhere have to be super duper careful it is my birthday weekend and i'm just gonna go to montreal a very quick spontaneous weekend trip i love it in montreal tonight i'm going out for a little dinner at this restaurant called soto soto and i have reservations at 9 15 6 p.m right now and i'm just dyeing my hair so i'm trying not to like stress because i love a good stress Good panic. I ended up getting hair dye on me. Hair dye is all through my hair now. I'm gonna leave it in for around 20 or so minutes. I just want to quickly thank PMD Beauty for sponsoring today's vlog. This is the PMD Clean Body. It's an all-in-one device where you can cleanse, exfoliate, and massage your body all in the shower. There are three heads and they're all magnetic and they stick on so easily onto the head just like that. And they all serve a different purpose. So if you want to massage, put that on. If you want to scrub the dead skin off of your feet, you can do that too. This side will just gently exfoliate your skin. And then this will, you know, you put your soap on and you have your loofah here. You can change it to whatever setting that you want. It vibrates. I can literally feel this device giving my skin a more deeper clean than just my regular loofah. There's a charging port right at the bottom. So this has lasted me about two months of daily use. I do have dry skin and this device has really been helping me adapt um, into the colder days. You know, we're heading into winter and this device has been helping me get a proper exfoliation in. That is super, super key before putting on your moisturizer or your body oils. So yeah, guys, click the link in my description box to get 5% off of current promos and use my code uh, Shoshana PMD to get 30% off of your own clean body device tool. And yeah, thank you PMD Beauty for sponsoring today's video and let's get back to my birthday vlog. 7.40, our reservations are at 9.15. I didn't even do my makeup yet. You know I'm late when I'm straightening my hair like this. Like this. What is going on? I should have probably calculated how long it would take me to do my hair. Cute. I've been, a, oh my god, my hair looks crazy. I've been a side part girly for the past two weeks now. I'm loving it. And I don't want to hear it. Keep your comments to yourself. If you are about to comment about my self-inflicted heat damage, I don't want to talk about it, okay? I know. Okay, I'm going to try this JVN Styling Blowout Milk. I literally love all JVN products, so first time using it, I'm just going to put it on my leave out. Hopefully, this is for this. I'm literally just winging it. I need to cut some like layers into my hair. I don't know. You know what I really desperately need? A wax stick, like to wax down all the flyaways. My birthday is on Friday, it's Wednesday. So I'm just gonna vlog all throughout this week and see what happens. Um, I am going to Montreal Friday to Sunday, so you guys will see that. And yes, I am using a dirty beauty blender. Sometimes it happens, you just don't have the time. The pressure is getting worse. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Stop messaging! <laughs> okay. okay, so this is the outfit. Oh my god, bitch, you're 26. This is crazy. It's a two piece. It's not a dress, but I'm just gonna make it look like a dress. I'm wearing these French tip on my toesies for the first time ever. I'm gonna get this from now on. This is so cute. This trench coat is thrifted. Hair is from Eunice. Did I forget to mention the face? The face is from my parents. Lashes are by Kiss. Happy birthday to me. Let's do a shot count of how many shots I take from now until Sunday. RIP to my lover. I thought that it came with 
a white sauce. Okay guys, I'm home. Quick update on that restaurant. I don't think I'll ever go back to Soto Soto. I did not have a good experience. Customer service and the food just wasn't it. The appetizers were cool, calamari, bruschetta, but the pastas were just not it. Whatever, we move on. Hopefully Montreal will bring way better experiences. The weekend still begins. I'm loving this black hair. It just brings out my features a lot more. See you tomorrow. Says that she has to get me a birthday box from here. This is amazing. This is just oh my goodness. Kind of hazelnut one, even though um, I can't. Are you enjoying it? That looks too chocolatey though. Like I don't like too chocolatey. This one. Yeah, that looks good. I need a butter garlic right now. These are I, I want to one die of those. for. I want a butter garlic. That looks hella good. It looks so good. Okay, can we do a box of six, please? Welcome, welcome back! It is my birthday, it's October 7th, and we're on route to Montreal. I got my little birthday drink. If you didn't know, now you know Starbucks gives you a free drink on your birthday, or if you want food, you can get that too. Lately, I've been really loving a grande iced chai tea latte with a double shot of espresso. If you, it's pretty expensive, it's like $8 for one drink, which is pretty ridiculous. If you guys know any type of hack, where I can get a chai latte, dopio, made differently to be cheaper if you work at Starbucks. Let me know the hack, please. I'm tired of paying almost $9 for a drink every time I get it. Just stop to get some gas. We have five more hours to go. This is a very spontaneous trip. Like we have nothing planned, obviously, to go to the famous Schwartz. We're gonna go to Essence. Um, we're also gonna go to Mount Royal. This is my second time going. No wait, third time going. I know there's so much more to see in Montreal, and that's a good thing about going to. I'm sorry if I'm not focused, but going to a city multiple times. There's always so many different things to see. Each time you go, you know, every time is a new experience. Let's go to Montreal. This is gonna be such a fun little birthday vlog. Bitch, are you reading? <laughs> yeah, I read. About what? This is, it's The Alchemist. I've been oh, reading the same book. You've been reading this for 10 years, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, then so, okay, first of all, <laughs> I'm almost done. Okay, I never finished it and I read it every time that I, I go back to it because I like highlighted some parts that I, that really stood out to me. And it's just about like guidance and direction in life. So every time you're feeling, feeling a little lost, just read The Alchemist, guys. It'll really help you. I still turn to a CEO, so the lifestyle she respect. Hey, two sprinters to Quebec. They only give niggas plus one, so I never pull up to the mat. You know I gotta bring Finally made it in Montreal just five hours later. We actually were here for about like two hours now. It took us a minute to find this Airbnb. We went to a completely different location, tried to go upstairs, tried to buzz the landlord, and we're like, this is not working. Turns out we're at the completely wrong address. So yeah, we drove 20 more minutes and came to this address. This is so cute. It has me considering moving to Montreal because the rent prices are phenomenal. I'm about to show you guys our view. A little bridge view. There's the bridge over there. On this side is just more condos. Right now, I door dash some McDonald's poutine because poutine is something that I've been craving a lot lately and their McDonald's here offers a completely different poutine So anyways, I ordered it. I want to get my reaction on camera Which McDonald's did you order? Because they're saying McDonald's on St. Catherine's near the Bay is the most disgusting thing I've ever had Oh, he dropped it to the lobby. He sent a picture. Okay, y'all can come with me. I'm gonna show you guys the lobby it is so aesthetically pleasing and you know i was a little concerned because i'm like it is way too cold to take my pictures outside so i'm so happy that this looks good enough for like instagram and stuff you know like i can make it work for sure but yeah here's my mcdonald's order i got it let's go try this poutine we made reservations for 9 p.m and it's like 7 and i'm starving i didn't have anything all day 
One thing about me is I always have to try McDonald's in different cities, different countries. I love McDonald's. What is the hype? Bon apple teeth, bitch. Oh, it does have gravy. Perfect. Okay, this is gonna be a perfect bite. Thank Give you me much. your genuine reaction. Let me know. If it was fresh. I'm so confused. What the fuck did I just eat? Is that a ginger chicken? Chop top? <laughs> <laughs> it's literally a chata. It's like what we would make if as kids gourmet. Better poutine to come tomorrow. Promise. Please leave in the comments places to hit up in Montreal for next time. I got recommended Ribbon Reef Steakhouse from Jet Bentley's vlog. I think he used to live in Montreal, so like I trust his food opinions, his restaurant opinions, so they didn't say the name. Okay, fine! Let's take a birthday shot! We don't have Chase. I can't take a shot. I'm sorry. Eat a fry. Ready, bitch? This is this is a shot. Big. Ready? It's not a lot. It looks too big. Okay. What's in my cup? What is that shit? That's a good question. <laughs> what? Is it like a bug? I don't know. What is it? I don't know. It just broke apart you. <laughs> right. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Whatever you say, man. Excuse me, are you taking a water shot? Cheers, guys. Thanks for coming on my third birthday on YouTube with me. Appreciate it. Look at this. I have to my pants. I never seen a moonshine like that. It never picks up on camera, but maybe it will today. Oh my God, guys, so why is the moon shining like this on my birthday? Okay. It doesn't look anything like this on camera. It's not giving no, on camera at all. Okay, it looks better on yours. I love this song. I'm going into a meeting with this damn turtleneck. It's not giving birthday, girl. <laughs> it's okay. Fuck it up if it's your birthday, bitch. Oh, you know we're eating good when I bring. <laughs> because bitch, I might die. Guys, we have to go. We have reservations at nine. It's eight thirty-two. It takes. Hurry. I'm gonna get a halibut fillet. The only halibut like I've had is that. <laughs> halibut. <laughs> you don't even eat salad. I'm actually. Montreal or should I say day de in Montreal we are getting ready for the day my look is not completed I'm getting ready to go take some pictures right now why am I doing this with no mirror Day two. We're on the way to a cafe. It's freezing outside. Freezing outside. If you guys are planning to come to Montreal in the fall, it's a lot colder than Toronto by like a couple of degrees. We'll be vlogging throughout my day. Yeah, I'm on, 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 I'm on
like that when I want like that. This thing got let's keep it a beam. No, they be mad at me on the scene. I still feel like I can't fit in a dream. It was my sister, but it's not what it's saying. I get down here, I'm keeping it clean. Fucking with us, that's the way I think. Say how you love me, but what do you mean? Pretty ass, nothing you like that on me. Gotta switch how you shitting me. If you ain't a body, can't sit with me. I swear that this bitch is my mini me. This feels so good out here. Mm. This one's good. Did he get this too? We so leave. Y'all know me. I literally only came here for short. Again, we're eating poutine again. We're going to Mapule Mule, which is a Portuguese, literally. Am I even Canadian? We're going to a um, Portuguese chicken, barbecue chicken place that also serves a barbecue chicken poutine. So it looks fantastic. I've seen a lot of TikToks about it and it has great reviews. So we're gonna just try out that. We're on the way there, we're walking right now and why can we literally smell the barbecue and we're like it's a maybe a three five minute walk it's taking over the entire street and the line was pretty long too so This is the last day in Montreal. It last, is last. so beautiful outside. Like, what a way to end the trip. We just left the Airbnb and now we're on the way to Crew Collective, which is a really aesthetically pleasing cafe here. And then we're gonna finally explore old Montreal. So that'll be fun. We're gonna hit up Essence and then we're back to Toronto. How is Montreal? Beautiful, magnifique. <laughs> oh, that's my new word now today. Nice. Word of the day, so, magnifique. Uh, it was beautiful and they have beautiful croissants and beautiful everything. Oh Their croissants here are I different. Hear no, I need another croissant before we dip out. So it's salmon, they have everything. 100%. I ain't got a clue, bro. Look how aesthetic. 
aesthetically pleasing this is. Look, a picture there. never gets old. This place is so stunning. Walking through my old Montreal never gets old. It never gets old. Like just how pretty it is. And why are y'all pastries so bomb? Are you all that you be? Tell me, baby. I don't mean it. Just give it me. 